guys! Welcome to Vlogmas. It's Lori and it's the 5th of December, so the five days in and that means we get to open a tea. So I'll really be opening the third uh, because we're doing this every other day. Where's my little pop? My little open it up thingy. Ow, I just bent my nail backwards. Let's do this properly, shall we? Get our thumbnail involved. Yeah, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Oh, pumpkin sp Oh. I didn't realize they have things written. Tea is contentment, and contentment is love of content. Drink, Drinking tea, desires diminish, and I come to see the ancient secret of happiness, wanting what I already have, the minister of leaves. Pumpkin spice. I know. Um, we'll have some of that later. It's the fifth. See what Jesus is up to today. Let's see, the fifth. Oh, the fifth is a cow. Let the dry rain down justice in the earth, but forth a savior. It's a cow. All right, we know what Jesus is up to. Um, we'll open something from Sarah. What should we open from Sarah? Something off the tree, maybe? No, we'll leave the trees for last. We'll open this one and, uh-oh, this is a Grinchy trivia, no cheating. In How the Grinch Stole Christmas, the Grinch was described with what three words? Stink, stank, stunk? Ha <laughs> ha! I'm a genius. How exciting! And let's see what's in this little package. Ooh. Socks. Guys, I love socks. Let me get Jesus off the ground. Here, I'll put him in here. <gasps> yes. I think these are little black dogs. Could be little black cats. Questionable. Cats or dogs? What do we think? Oh, I'm excited. I'm going to wear these to work tomorrow. Socks today. Oh, cheese. It's time for cheese, which is perfect because I'm hungry. It's lunchtime. So today's cheese. Now, there's only 12 flavors in here. I think they duplicate a couple. So at the 12th day, we'll probably be repeating, which I'm not mad about. Count out. Double Gloucester cheese. Mellow, buttery, and smooth. Mellow, buttery, and smooth. Well, I will let you know after I have my lunch. So we got some cheese. I love cheese. I actually have ham heating up. Um, our woobles, which I have not heard back from them yet. Oh, I did get a comment that maybe they assume that you already have this stuff. But I feel like this is a company that touts teaching people how to crochet. So this should be a beginner kit. So we're on the fifth day um ornament hooks i think i think for what i don't know but i think these it just says hooked on christmas let's pull one out and see yeah yeah i think these are ornament hooks i think so maybe I'm making some ornaments. I, I don't know. Definitely too big for an ornament, I think. I think that's too big for an ornament. So we'll see. So on the fifth day of Christmas, we received ornament hooks. Got it. Which was a surprise because I hadn't, I didn't have to open that one to find the hook. I did take the hook out. So we will have nothing on the 18th. And then last but not least, our stitchy advent now yesterday was pottery and so I haven't done yesterday's but it wasn't a lot so that's good I will do that tonight with this one and you must always check your bags 
got it. Okay, okay. Ooh, pretty. Yonder, this is a gorgeous blue. Guys, that is gorgeous. I love it. And it says, December 5th, winter is a time for sitting around the fire, drinking hot toddies, and telling tall tales. Over at my YouTube channel, you can now listen to a winter tale. It's not only the season for tales, but also for Christmas crackers and the inevitability awful jokes in them. So today I gift you a bad joke as well. Uh, what happened to the snowman who got angry? He had a meltdown. <gasps> Jacob. All right, we have more counting to do. Jacob's going to be in trouble. But I can deal with this counting. So I have more counting to do today. We're going to be counting a lot. But if that means I get to stitch with this beautiful color, I am all for it. Here, we'll taste this cheese and see if it truly is creamy and mellow. And then I will show you my, um, in a little bit, well, for you it'll be next, but I made a positive potato and a emotional support pickle. Mmm. Yep, creamy. Mild. Mmm. Delicious. I love cheese. All right, that's it for the events, I think. Yep, that was everybody. I'm going to eat lunch. Because I'm on my lunch break making this part of the video. I know. And then I will show you what I crocheted. Okay, I got some things to show you. I made these for friends and family. I'm dying here, guys. This is... Look at the little bumps. It is a pick, the positive pickle. And it, oh, I'm sorry. This is an emotional support pickle. And it says, I will always be around to let you know you are a big dill. A big dill. Uh, I love it. So that's the positive. No, I'm sorry. The emotional support pickle. And this is the positive potato. And it says... I may be a tiny potato, but I believe in you. Go do your thing. I'm dying, guys. So these are the ones I made to give away. I made them with acrylic yarn. They're super cute. But wait, you see what I made for me? For my desk. Uh, oh, I'm dead. what is that? Lint? Yes. I was cutting um, polar fleece. And there's lint everywhere. This is mine. His little eyes are hard to see, but he has eyes. This is made out of plush yarn. It's, I think it's Juicy Couture brand, but it's got glitter in it. So this is my emotional support pickle. And then my positive potato I made with um, this plush yarn from the Dollar Tree. So these are mine. I gotta get some stands. So I'm gonna set them on my desk at work. Um, I think those Christmas trees that are on the little base from the Dollar Tree, if I have some kicking around, I can take them apart and just shove. I know, right? Those are so cute. And they were so fast to crochet up. So, I have that. And then I got an order in the mail. I wanted to show you what I got. So, I did the... Um, candle sale from Bath and Body Works. I ordered online. The extra $7 shipping was well worth it for me to not have to go in. And this was an online exclusive, the Top Shelf Elf. It smells like candy. What are its notes? Hold on. The notes are... I know it's orange, doesn't say. It used to tell me what the notes were. But it's fruity, it's oranges and, I don't know why it doesn't say. Oh. Billions of toys. Oh, billions of toys in just one year? Yes, sometimes even elves need a little boost of energy. 
high concentration of rich fragrance oils. It doesn't say, but it's fruity. I read it online. So I got that one. It's delicious. Um, I ordered two others, but those are not for me. This one and the El Top Shelf Elf and I think the Perfect Christmas were online exclusives. Oh, it's cinnamon. It's Christmas tree. Guys, it's everything. And then some. And I love how shiny the label is. Let's see if there's any notes listed on this one. Fresh cut pine, cinnamon, sugar, toasted marshmallow. Oh, I love the fresh cut pine. It does smell like the perfect Christmas. So this was an online exclusive as well. And guys, I'll burn Christmas candles year round. Not a problem for me. This one is, what's happening here? This box, it looks like it was already open, so I'll just rip it open. This is my candle. I love, too, that I order these online, and they come in boxes, so when I have a couple for gifts, they're already boxed up. This one is Balsam Firewood. Oh, that smells like winter. The notes of this are cedar wood, cardamom, white birch. Oh, so good. So good. I don't think that one was an online exclusive. I think just the two were. But I will tell you, if I don't have to go in the store, what is happening here? Some of these you can open like a gift box and some are sealed. But the good thing is the ones I'm gifting are not sealed. <gasps> oh, this is called Tis the Season. I've had this one before. There's glue all over this too. But look at the color. Oh, that is heavily cinnamon. The notes in this one are rich red apple, sweet cinnamon, and cedar wood. Oh delicious. I can't wait to burn this. This one might be an upstairs candle. Do you guys have that like upstairs, downstairs candles? Or am I the only crazy person? And you can tell me if I'm the only crazy person. I think I can get into this one. Let's see. Yeah, I think this is maybe. Oh, let's not go ripping my nails apart, which I just did. Okay, we'll fix that one. I gotta clip my nails. Okay. And then, oh, Pure Wonder. Guys, I got this in um, shower gel and body spray. I love it. Yeah, this is definitely gonna be a bedroom scent. Like, I'll burn this in my bedroom and look at the glitter. So these were my candles from Candle Day, and I got a couple gifts as well for Candle Day for, um, I picked up a couple for some other folks since I was already making the order, and the shipping was going to be $7 no matter what. Um, I will tell you, though, I feel like if you wait and play your cards right, you can get a good, I'm clipping my nail while we're talking, a good sale and still get close to the $10 price. I mean, it, it definitely would not have been worth it to me to go and um, stand in line for hours on end. I have done that. I am not, I don't want to ever do that again. So, and I didn't have to. I know my friend who I ordered for, she ended up going after work and she said there was no line. So I think a lot of people this year are just, they're just not willing to stand in all these long lines. Also, I feel like um, they're extending all the sales out for more than just the one day. Like the candle sale was 
three days, really. They let rewards members go in on Friday, and then they had it in store on Saturday and Sunday. So there was three days of candle sale. But I feel like a lot of, of the stores are extending their sales out past just the one day. But I don't know. Anyway, so that is what I bought at Bath & Body Works and my little um, pickle and potatoes. I'm sorry, my nails, I just clipped them all because they're dry and pottery. I did take some footage at pottery, but I wanna wait till I actually get the items back to show you. So I did a before and after, I, before I painted them and after I painted them, and then I wanna do an after I fired them. So there's that. All right, I think we're done for today. I will get this video loaded and I will talk to you tomorrow on the 6th. I'm having a gingerbread latte, iced Nespresso. So it's a gingerbread espresso latte. Mm, so good. All right, talk to you later. Bye.